How is your day so far? And I am getting ready to go on the road. So I want to take you along with me. So I'm getting ready to go on the road. Yes, I will just tease it up a bit. So guys, I will take you along with, with me to Walmart. I want to see to believe for myself, you know. My YouTube sister is saying, oh, there's nothing much at Walmart. So I want to go in Walmart in my area. I will take you along with me. If there's a Walmart in your area, tell me if you have that problem. There is nothing much on the shelves, no food and so on. So I will take you along there. But before we go to Walmart, I want to take you to my back, my outdoor space. I just want to share with you or show you for a summer how you can, um, with your space, how you can, if you have an open space, how you can use that if you want to spend some time outdoor. So I want to share that with you. Um, last year, I think it was last year, I'm not too certain, I can't remember. It was either last year or the year before my husband and I, we did a little area where we put down those pavers and the pavers, guys, we bought those pavers from Home Depot, but you can get them from Lowe's. I think you can get them from anywhere that deal with um, anything to do with blocks or concrete blocks. After summer last year, we didn't do nothing much out there. When the cold came through so we're gonna make it look beautiful for this summer so i just want to share that with you and i just want to show you if you have a nice area in your backyard and you just want to spend some time outdoor what you can do in that area if you want to put your if you have your outdoor furniture if you have your chair your plastic chair and you want to get cushions and you want to make your outdoor space look beautiful there's so many things you can do in your outdoor space if you have umbrella to you have those big outdoor umbrella and you want to just make your space beautiful for the summer it don't it can be you can be living anywhere in this world and you want to beautify your area i will take you out there before i go to walmart and show you what i will be doing in that open space i want to share these ideas with you and these ideas remember you don't have to pay on my channel on my platform all i'm asking you to do is thumbs up share with your family and, and most of all subscribe don't forget before you leave to subscribe. And if this is your first time here, my name is Martha and I am so happy. I am so happy to welcome you to my home to share with you all my ideas that I put on my platform, my YouTube platform from time to time. And for those who are here, you guys know you are always, always welcome to my home. So guys, let me just jump right into getting ready. So I just want to put on these loops. I don't know where I bought these from, but I just want to put these on. Nothing special. Yeah. Guys, so this is it here. And I'm just going like that on the road <laughs> nothing special you know yeah nothing special so what is your plan for today what are you doing today what are you doing today i don't know what to do with this light is to switch out from the ring light and put on the natural light look at my hair guys in the color in here it's not a permanent color if i go right now wash this out it will come out but yeah let's have this color yeah. 
So guys, whatever you're doing, make sure you stay safe. When it's big. <laughs> yes. This is the hair look for today, guys. So just let me get ready. So I'm wearing this denim dress today. This is my outfit for today. Just keeping it cool here. I bought, bought this something from Ross or Walmart, one of those places. So guys, I still have it here. I love it, especially in the summertime. I just put it on and I go about my business. Yes. So guys, let me take you to back there to show you what I was talking about. Oh, and by the way. Notice this frame over here. You notice the design here. That is a peel. Is it what how do you say? Oh, that is the peel and stick. And I put it here in the wall. So I want to do a tropical theme in my bathroom. So I came up with that idea over here. But I have to do the other one. And the frame I got from um, Ross, I forgot to show this in my haul. This frame came from Ross. Yeah. So I will put this one right here. I think right here and yeah, I have to open this case and put it here so it will be like that. But I will bring you closer so you can see what I did. And these are just you know ideas. You can do your bathroom on a budget. You don't have to expense yourself. It all depends on you and your pocket. So this is just my thing here. And I really like how it turned out over here. So let me share that with you. Nothing much is going on over here. I have my color here. And this is a napkin ring I bought from, I can't remember. I don't ever remember the name when it comes to this napkin ring. Somewhere was closing down and they had these things on a table, you know, and they had this one napkin ring. And I, I said, what can I, is it Pier 1? I think that's the place that closed down in my area. So yeah, they had these things I saw this and I said, so. I will bring you close up to see what I did. And for it to fit around around the towel, let me show you what I did. This is it guys. Isn't this beautiful? So look what I did. See? I saw I I cut open the back and and I sprawl it open. So if you're looking to do something like this in your bathroom. You just have to use sometimes look around in your home and use what you have and that is what I did so it's here it's always in here in my bathroom so yes I love it it's gold it's gold plated or whatever you call it so I have it right over here so I don't have to bring you close up to see this one anymore so this is it over here if I want I can, you have to be careful when you're sprawling so you make sure you don't wrench it off of the um, wrench off the ring at the back so if you have a nice table napkin ring and you want to bring it into your you have an extra one by the way you want to bring it into your you want to do a DIY you want to do like what I did here it's gonna be awesome 
look for something you might you you never know look around in your home and these are things you know you can do in your home so let me just bring it over here so you can see how i just tried to bring in that like tropical give it a little tropical vibe in here so guys let's just go outdoor so i can share that with you so this is my hair for today i don't know Tell me what you think about my natural I'm just loving this hair. I'm just loving my hair, guys. So I think this will be my hair for the summer. Sometimes I will pull on a bit if my hair is in a mess and I don't have time to twist and loose it out and all of that. But this is it here. This is Marta. Okay, so guys, let's go outdoor what's going on out there before i go let me show you that to bring you close up so guys this is it here for the pitta frame the peel and stick i bought from the doll three store so the other one that i will be doing will go below here i will put and i really like how it turned out here just simple yet pleasing to me i love my diy and it, this is giving me the summer tropical vibes so guys i hope you like So guys, this is what I was talking about, my outdoor space. This is the pavers just around the patio. Yes, we have them in like a mixed tone, like a red brick and the clear brick. So this is our little space over here. My husband, I think he has to complete that patch there. Some pavers are missing from over here. So this is it, guys. And you're gonna see the transformation for over here it's gonna look so beautiful some of you just want to spend a lot of time outdoor so we're gonna set up over here during the summertime it's be so beautiful out here had a lot of um, dry leaves I don't know when he blow them away but yeah so the, this these are um, decorative, is the decorative pebbles, or outdoor pebbles. So guys, this is it. And we will be transforming this space out here for the summer. And I just want to share this with you. So guys, this plant here came from um, Home Depot. I love this tropical plant. I don't think I want this. Mm -mm. I don't want this this particular plant here. I don't want my plants to die this year. So I think what I will do to try to save them, I will try to put them in the patio area. Yes, I will try to do that. Put them in the patio area, and we will try to like just do something when the cold come through. It kill it kill your plants out. So the temperature for the tropical plant, no, it's not good. But during the summer, oh, they look so beautiful outdoors. So guys, I just want to share that with you. So let's go to Walmart. <laughs> 